What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, if you click the little bell and follow me, I'd super duper appreciate you saying, saying, saying. I did get one message in as I was meditating on daily teeth energy, and the message is I heard it pretty big. I heard Mufasa real big. I mean, that's how I heard it. Mufasa. Um, so. I equate that to the Lion King, if anybody's seen the Lion King. Um, that's basically Scar. Scar is the evil um, family member of um, Mufasa, the evil brother of Mufasa and the evil um, uncle of um, Simba. And um, he had, he wouldn't be top dog. He wouldn't be top dog. He wouldn't be king. And he basically had, he basically killed Mufasa, which was his brother, and um, tried to kill um, Simba. I mean, that freaking serious. Just saying. So, um, but that's what I heard was Mufasa. So it was like Scar, like pr trying to put on evil omens. To Mufasa, and it did, it did succeed to Mufasa. He ended up killing him um, and tried with Simba, but it backfired on his ass. Um, but you, um, you, you check it out, resonates. And um, the it, I, it's like 1.5 messages because, like, 30 seconds after I heard Mufasa, I heard um, someone is ident identifying um, a, a family snake. So you take it out, resonates. Someone is identifying a family snake. So I'm thinking for whoever this resonates with, it could be your family you're identifying it in or somebody else's family or both. You take it out, resonates. But um, I'm thinking you're identifying a scar in your life. Absolutely, I do. Um, absolutely. Now, you know, scar, spirit messages you have for us like this. Um, scar did not... He had like this secret life, this secret double life, and he didn't um, come off to the kingdom as, um, you know, evil, or he didn't try to, but it just came out because he really was. Um, so you take it how it resonates. Um, obviously, that's very significant for at least one person. Um, someone's about to have a huge wake up call. This is what I just heard just now. Someone's about to have a huge wake-up call. Okay, so um, if that's you or somebody you're connected to, um, maybe you're identifying a scar in your life is what I'm thinking. That's exactly what I'm thinking. In your family or somebody else's uh, family? Um, I, I, I frequently I do um, think that. Um, given the messages and, um, and all that. Um, so... Mufasa, and then someone is um, identifying basically a family snake. Uh, it could be their family, somebody else's family. You take out residents. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't fly, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages um, that resonate with you. I heard get another one. This is what I got, and I heard get another one. Look at the bigger picture. Full moon and such. Okay, a new start is coming, new moon. I heard get another one. Oh, God. Okay. Hope everybody's doing okay today. Oh, yeah, daily tea. A little different than the other uh, readings. It's a more general current pulling of the energy. It's supposed to resonate 24 to 72 hours out from the time that you view it. However, everyone's on different time of life time. So for some of you guys, it could resonate outside the 72 hour time frame. Just saying. Um, just saying, just saying. Oh, I was going to tell you guys, too, while I'm shuffling and I'm thinking about it. I am picking up on Thursday at work. I'm normally off on Thursday, and I was going to start some mid-week uh, readings. Um, luck is on your side, new moon and Sag. Lots of Sag energy in here. Lots of Sag energy. Um, I was going to start the readings. Um, but... I'm picking up on Thursday because it's very well worth it to pick it up on Thursday. Just trust me. So <laughs> I'm picking it up. <laughs> um, you have to, you know, take the opportunity. So I am. Um, so I won't be here on Thursday night. 
um, and Wednesday night, my daughter has a softball banquet. Um, so I definitely, um, I might be on here for a little while on Wednesday because, you know, I'm supposed to be off Wednesday and Thursday, but this week I'm only off on Wednesday. Wait, girl, girl, I work every other day this week, um, which I chose to do it that way. Oh, that's my kid. Okay, I chose to do it that way um, for strategic purposes. Um, just saying. Um, um, but saying that, I might start some readings. I might. Um, but I'm not going to start down the line, caps through Sag. Um, I mean, I'll start with caps. But what I'm trying to say is I've been um, doing what spirit, um, whatever sign spirit guides me to do. So if it's not caps and it's Aries, um, just saying. I mean, I will start tentatively as caps, but it may not be. Um, if I hear from different for spirit or I feel guided differently to do different. I just want, and I'm doing that from now on because I feel like that's the best way to do it. I get more spirit messages that way. Um, intuitively guided, uh, intuitive guidance is better that way um, for on the light working side. Um, on this, put yourself in my shoes. I'm just saying. And it, it just, I feel it's better in the spirit realm. I mean, I'm, I was chosen to do this for a reason. And if they tell me to do a sign, I'm going to do a sign. So just saying. Um, so look at the bigger picture of full moon and Sag. We're all about identifying family snakes um, in here. Somebody. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Hello. Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you. All right. Bye. Okay. Sorry. Let's make his doctor's appointment. Uh, kids' doctor's office confirming the appointment. Oh, hold on a second. Let me just make sure. I've been working so much lately. We've had so many appointments come up uh, recently. I mean, not like unexpected appointments, but just come up. So I, let me just make sure. Yep. Yep. Okay. So, yeah. So saying that, like I said, um, I might start the readings. I might not. But um, tomorrow, Wednesday, is the only day I am off this entire week of seven-day span. Um, so... And I, I chose to do it that way. So just saying, look at the bigger picture of full moon and Sag. Like I said, we're all about identifying um, family um, snakes in here, apparently. Um, two Sag cards, just to let you know. Um, you you could be a Sag or have Sag in your chart. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, the behavior of Jupiter. Um, or not. You take it out, resonates. Um, fire sign or fire sign energy. Because Sag is fire sign energy. It is Leo Sag. So look at the bigger picture of full moon and Sag. Someone is really putting the pieces together now. Okay, I so heard someone is really putting the pieces together now. So you take it out resonates. I'm thinking you're putting the pieces together, identifying a family snake, a scar, in either your family or somebody else's family. And I'm serious. A new start is coming. If you don't know what I'm talking about, um, if you've never seen The Lion King, Disney's The Lion King, um, rent it um i would suggest renting it if you want to watch it but that's what i'm equating this reading to um i mean it's a very popular movie it's a disney movie it's called the lion king a new start is coming new moon Lots of new beginnings for new people in many ways. Okay, I heard lots of new beginnings for many people in um, many ways. So you take it out, resonate. So um, a new start, a new beginning. Um, may, um, I'm thinking you're identifying this scar in your family or somebody else's family. Um, and you are, I would hope, separating yourself away. I hope you're not one of the hyenas. 
chilling with Scar. I'm just saying. Um, you take it out resonates in your own life, but I hope you're getting the wake-up call and get the hell out of the evil side of the animal kingdom. Just saying. But you take it out resonates. Luck is on your side, new moon and Sag. Someone is about to have wonderful a wonderful stroke of luck because their intuition, they're using their intuition. Wonderful stroke of luck for them and going to pay it forward to other and others. Okay, so you check it out. Resonates. I heard someone's about to have a look. wonderful, wonderful stroke of luck because um, either you or somebody are connected to because you are using your intuition. You are and you're about to pay it forward. Some of you guys to one person and some to several people. Um, so you have luck is on your side. But you're using your intuition, meaning you're getting out of the evil side of the animal kingdom. Is exactly what I'm thinking. I think you're cutting a scar out of your life. Or you're about to. Um, and I, we're all about family energy in here um, today. So I, I tr truly think it's either someone physically in your fa in your family or in somebody else's family. Um, but you're identifying a scar in, in a family unit. Is, um, whether it's your family or somebody else's family. And I'm serious about that. I feel guided to get these. I didn't hear it, but I feel guided to get them. Spirit messages do you have reflected. Shaman, Ancient Healing Wisdom. Someone's ancestors have been on them in the dreamscape really badly. To do a specific thing. Do it. Okay, so you take it out. Resonates. I heard someone's ancestors have been on them to do a specific thing. And then I heard do it. Um, so like Nike, just do it, baby. Um, you take it out. Resonates. But um, I heard your ancestors have been on you in your dreamscape so in your dreams. So for who this resonates with, you dream. Obviously you dream. Now some people don't dream. I've always dreamed as a little girl and as a 37-year-old woman. Always have. Um, always, always. And it's just gotten heavier for me. But everybody's different. But some people don't dream. Um, they just don't. Um, but I've never been one of those people. Um, but um, whoever this resonates with, you do dream. You do dream. And apparently you're getting um, intuitive messages from spirit. Like spirit messages. Um through your dreamscape and it's from a ancestor so it's someone that used to live currently you know, someone that used to live on the earth with us on the 3d earth with us but does not live here anymore so they have passed away to the spirit world so now they are coming to you in spirit form in the form of your dreamscape kind of like when i started um before i started receiving spirit messages from um from the spirit world, my dad started coming to me in dreamscape, if anybody doesn't know that. But that's what happened to me. And, of course, that was one of my ancestors. Um, and I still get dreams from him to time to time, um, dream, from the dreamscape, um, from the spirit world, from in the form of my dad. Um, I just, I do, still now, um, if anybody wants to hear that. But, um, but somebody else is. At least one of you guys are. You're getting um, dreams from somebody. Um I think one of your guardian angels in the spirit realm that used to live um, on the earth with us, but does not anymore. But I heard they're really pushing you basically to do something in your dreamscape. And I heard from spirit, do it. So whatever in the world they're pushing you to do, or they're trying to get you to do in your dreamscape, I heard do it. So you take it out, resonates. Um, I don't feel guided to get any more. Okay. An affair is about to be exposed in a huge way. 
as well as someone's secret addiction. Okay, well, um, I heard an affair is about to be exposed in a huge way as well as someone's secret addiction. Um, so you take it how it resonates, um, whatever secret addiction that is for somebody. Um, it could be a person, it could be a place, it could be a situation, it could be an orgy. Hell, I don't know, people. Um, whatever the secret addiction is, um, that's about to be revealed. And I heard an affair is about to be exposed as well. Um, so you take it how it resonates. Um, I think we're done. All right. Personal readings currently closed. Donations greatly appreciated. Um, I love you guys so freaking much. I do, I do, I do. All right. Love y'all. Namaste. Oh, share, share, share the videos. Share, share, share the videos. I'd appreciate it. Me and my squeaky chair. Namaste.